Okay, we'll begin with a uh, comment from Coach Hoffner, and then we'll take a couple questions. Coach Hoffner, please. Thanks, Paul. Um, hard fought game. Southwest State gave us all they had tonight. 21-7 uh, game at halftime. Uh, highly contested. I think it was important for us to get out and score early in the second half. We make it 28-7, and it was that way for quite a while. Uh, got some late uh, points, but I thought for you know for a lot of guys being out on our squad, I think it took a lot of guys like leadership like Nate and Michael here to step up uh, and to fill in those voids of players we had out tonight and bring home a victory for the Mavericks. Thanks, Doug. A couple questions here. Michael, uh, how important was it to get off the field that first drive without giving up points? Um, I mean, that was huge. You know, I think uh, it gave the offense a lot of momentum. You know, always it's always our goal, you know, to not let the offense score any points. So, you know, um, us being out there, you know, them missing the field goal was huge, you know, and uh, it was just executed well towards the end, and, you know, they got the field, so. What did you guys change up then? Because obviously they didn't do that too many more times after after that first drive. Um, I think a lot of it was just, you know, uh, with the first drive, you know, it, the fact that it was the first drive, you know, and first game of the season, you know, everybody might have, you know, some pregame jitters and whatnot. And, but after that, you know, I think uh, we just really stepped up, you know, locked in, focused, and, you know, got it done um, as far or after the first drive, so. And Nate, the, you had to sit there for quite a while on the sideline before you guys got that first shot. So just what was the mood like in the huddle there when you finally got out there and, you know they hadn't scored. I mean, I feel like as an offense, we're pumped up. You know, we were after you know they missed the field goal. Felt that we went out there with great energy. You know, our defense we bend, but we don't break. You know, so I think that we went out there with the mentality that like, hey, defense did their job. Let's go do our job. Todd, how about the the ability to, or the to get out of that first drive without giving up points? Just how big do you think that was to? What turned out to be kind of the lopsided game? Sure. I thought Southwest State had a great game plan. Uh, they were attacking the boundary with uh, the run and the pass, and they drove the ball down, got very close uh, to scoring some points in the red zone. Uh, but our defense stepped up big time. Uh, great momentum shift, uh, having them miss a field goal, taking about six minutes off the clock and some change. And then we came back, went the length of the field, and scored. And that, that was fairly devastating to a Southwest team that I thought had a great game plan coming into the football game. Nate, the offense has got a, a lot of attention here in the offseason. Uh, just how would you assess how things went tonight just for the offense as a whole? I think that uh, Southwest definitely came to play. You know, they definitely challenged us. So uh, my big thing that I like about you know, was up front, the quarterbacks, you know, wide receivers, they, all of us on the offense unit that you know, we just got together and just you know, kept communicating what we had to do, what we were seeing, you know, what they were doing, just kept talking about them. So I think that that's a sign of you know, leadership and a winning team. You know? So they went out there, like I said, they played, that's really good. You know, it's a good football team, we just happened to be the better team today. So. Todd, you had a chance to put the ball in your player maker's hands in this game. Pretty happy with how the distribution went tonight offensively? Yeah, I think uh, ball distribution was very good. Uh, it was nice to get Shane some catches down the stretch, uh, but we definitely wanted to feed Nate in the first game, and I think the whole line was very excited about that and our ability to run the football. But I thought they protected pretty well. You know, we gave up a couple sacks and hurries, uh, but you know, all in all, it was a, a great effort. I don't know exactly what the yardage was, but uh, putting up 49 points, I'm sure we were close to the 400 yard mark. Uh, in, in the yardage, so um, it was a great output, and uh, you know we we're probably closer to 500. But uh, we can't do that unless the defense uh, does a great job and getting the ball back to the offense. That I thought, you know, there were a few drives. That second touchdown they scored uh, in the third in uh, the third quarter, uh, and it was something that I thought our offense went three and out. They stole some momentum. We punted it down. It was a short punt, and then they went in and punched it in. So. And that was following uh, unsportsmanlike conduct that we had and kicking the ball from our own 20. So we kicked the ball from our 20, we stopped them, they punted it back to us, we went three and out, and we punted it back to them and then they scored. So there was a culmination of uh, a couple of drives and a couple of series there uh, that you know we got to clean some things up and nobody's perfect, but we got a lot to build on and we expect to get a lot better from game one to game two. One more question? Like, uh, 
given all the, the new kids or, or new players in on the defense there, just, how do you think that went as, as the night went along? Um, you know, I think for the new guys, you know, um, they definitely got the hang of it as the night went on. Um, you know, kind of here we have the next guy up mentality, so, um, you know, it doesn't really matter if you're young, you know, you, we expect, you know, everybody to perform at a high level here, so um, I think the young guys, you know, for the most part did a, few, or did a good job. Um, obviously, there were a few mental busts, you know, and it might have cost us, but, you know, that's, here it's the first game, you know, that's probably going to happen, but, um, you know, we can always improve, so um, next week, you know, and throughout the season, you know, hopefully we improve, you know. Nate, just... You know, you had a long off season and kind of a short off season, but uh, just to get that first win under your belt to, to start things going, just, just how does it feel to be able to celebrate here again? I think it feels great. You know, we uh, are not for so long. He's been one and zero all uh, off season. We talked about going out there and winning this game. So finally, you know, all the hard work that we had to do for uh, fall camp. All of our uh, winter workouts, all the guys that stayed for the summer. This is all what we're talking about. We're going on one and zero for this week right here. We end the win out there. We went one and zero, so you know it feels great that we accomplished something that you know everyone worked so hard, the sweat, tears, injuries, and you know, everyone put their bodies on the line. Okay. All right. Thanks very much. Thank you. Thank you.